In this video, you are given four arrangements of springs and you are asked which arrangement has the same spring constant as a single spring. Okay, let's think about this. If you're talking about one spring, it means that if I place the load on a single spring, the same load, so I'm just going to give all of these Fs, not because they failed, but the load, the force is F, la, okay? So right now, if I place the same force F here and the extension is X, then using our good old F is equal to KX, okay, your uh, spring constant K, the original, the single origin, the one spring K is F over X. Okay, so we're going to park that aside, all right? And now we want to find another arrangement that has the same as this one. And immediately A and B I can throw away already because you know why? If you have a spring in series like this, it means that you have a force F, you have a force F, you have a force F, yep. Okay, so and your extension is X and X. So if you want to use, you know, the total F is equal to the new, let's say this is Ka, then the total X, okay? So what force are we actually loading? We're only loading with F, okay? It's just one force, okay? Although the spring is supporting F, the actual thing that is being supported is just F, okay? So although spring 1 is supporting F, spring 2 is supporting F, but I actually only hang one F word. So that's why this is F, though, okay? And this is Ka, and this is 2X. It's pretty obvious here that uh, my Ka is equal to F over 2X and it's not the same as F over X. I need to... No. GG. Okay, never mind. Let's try the next one. This one is side by side, so they share the load. I hang F, but each of the spring just take F over 2. So now I can take total is Kb times X. Because this is F over 2, Half the load means half the extension. Okay, so although they both still have the same load, I mean the, the load that I put on the system is still F, but the extension is halved. So from here, I will get KB is equal to 2F over X. So as you can see, this is not F over X, A and B is out. All right, what about C? Well, if you look at this, um, one side will take f over 2, the other side will also take f over 2. But because they are kind of parallel, right? So they, sh they share half and half, but also at the same time, these two are series. So it is more of you are f over 2 and I support f over 2. And the same thing as this is f over 2. This is f over 2. Okay, and these two are in series. Okay, so in this case, one side take f over 2, but because they are in series, so everything in series will have the same force and repeat for this side. So again, we can do the total force is equal to kx. Just going to write that down. Ft is equal to Kcx, okay? But right now, the force that we load is still F, it's the same load. And what is the extension? Well, this one get x over 2 because the force is F over 2. This is x over 2. This is x over 2. This is x over 2. So imagine, right, you have both sides total extension is x over 2 plus x over 2. Wait a second, we have F is equal to KCX. So spring constant for arrangement C is F over X. The answer is C. Okay. You can show working like that, or you actually can just know this is out, this is out, this is very out. So the answer is C already. You don't really need to calculate one, but I'm just calculating for those of you who actually want to do so. So what about this one, teacher? Well, very simple, Nick. Layer one. Support the load F. Layer 2, share the load. Share, share. Ah. So this is F over 2. This is F over 2. 
You can do the layer one, layer two thing, a uh, way of looking at this one as well can. This must this layer must load F. So F over two, F over two. The layer on top also will load F. So F over two, F over two. Each layer will load F. So can. So in this case, uh I guess the extension here for this layer is x over two, and the extension for this layer is x. So I can use F right here. Total force is equal to spring constant for D times X. Total force is always F because we always use the same load. And the total extension here is half plus X, which is 1.5 X, okay? Or 3X over 2. Okay, I write the whole thing. X over 2 plus X. 3X over 2. So this one is actually 2F over 3x. Obviously not correct law. All right. So different ways that uh, I can modify this question include uh, asking you to arrange in ascending or descending order the spring constant or the stiffness. Of course, the one that is the most stiff, okay, is this one. Hardest to extend. The easiest to extend one is this one. Okay, because it's 0 0.5 fx, f over x, 2 f over x, 1 f over x, and 0 0.67 f over x. Okay, so if you stay calm, understand that for every single layer, if let's say you have multi-layer stacking of spring, every single layer have to support the load f. And then if that layer got friend beside you, you share no? half half. If got three friend beside you, f over 3, f over 3, f over 3. Unless the spring don't have the same spring constant. Okay, and that will be another video and I will see you in, I don't know, whichever video you click on. Bye-bye. Yeah.